Hello, welcome to Divine Grace Parish. This is Father Jim Wainer, the pastor of the parish. Uh, each Monday, I release a little bit of reflection on who we are as parish, who we are as church. So today, I wanted us to consider, uh, as we profess every Sunday, the articles of faith. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. So today, and throughout this week, I would like us to reflect on that first article of faith. I believe in one church. Our Lord, as he uh, was dying on the cross for our salvation, prayed on that Good Friday that we all be one, that all Christians, all believers of him, that we would be one, and it's not the case, right? We are a divided Christianity. Uh, as Catholics, we believe that we possess the unity of our faith, the unity of the church, the unity of the gospel that our Lord gives to us. However, from a spiritual standpoint, the first reflection is this. As an individual Catholic, where do we experience division in our hearts? I believe in one church. So it begins with our own personal relationship with the Lord, our personal relationship with faith, our own personal relationship as a disciple of Jesus. So how is that undermined? How, how do you feel undermined in your spiritual life? We have to be able to discern this because emotion, ideology, friction, all the things that can undermine our human nature can actually impact and diminish our Catholic faith as well. So on Sunday when we make that article of faith, I believe in one church. What is that unity of faith that you're experiencing today and where is that undermined it? Uh, in your spiritual life, with your friendships, with your family, at work, at home, where is that undermined so that you can invite the divine grace of God into that situation? As we often sing during Advent, O come, O come, Emmanuel, come into my mess, come into my darkness, come into my frustration, come into the friction that I have right now, heal it, unify it, uh, bring me closer to your divine grace, Lord. So as we start this new week, I'm asking uh, every parishioner, um, every Catholic who may be seeing this, to be very intentional about calling forth God's divine grace into those aspects of your life where there is disunity. And the greatest part of that disunity is sin. Is it pornography? Is it wasting of time? The abuse of alcohol? Laziness? Uh, a, a mediocrity of, of how we're living our faith? A, a diminished prayer life? Where is sin dividing that unity that Christ does not want us to experience. If every Catholic is able to bring to the body of Christ a unity, uh, a firmness, a steadfastness, a foundation, that builds up the body of Christ. But if we're bringing sin, cynicism, pessimism, negativity, anger, that's not going to build up the body of Christ. It's going to shatter it. It's going to undermine it. And we're a new parish, and might there even be aspects of disunity within the parish because we're holding on to some of that negativity. So as we start this new week, may God's divine grace be with each of you. Please pray for me as I pray for you. God's peace be with you.